Hello friends, in this video I would be showing you how we can run ME51N decode in SAP which is used for creating purchase requisition. So let's go quickly to the SAP window, SAP software and let's run ME51N. ME51N. So that's how the window of purchase requisition looks like. So over here the material field, the quantity and the plant is mandatory. So we'll select these fields and then we are done and let's see how we can do it. So if you don't know the name of the code of your material, you can take the option or you can click on helper or by F4 you can search for the code of your material or the name of your material and then you can just select directly over there and if you know the T code or the code, the code or the name you can directly put. So I over here I know the T code. But the code for my material is T hyphen ST, which is which represents my metal sheets. That I'll enter over there. I'll put the quantity as 99. And as I said, plant is important. Plant we need to select. So my plant, which has been tagged with this product, is thousand. So I'll select thousand, and that's it. These three details which we need to put in purchase requisition, and we can see by control S. And yes, we have create successfully created a purchase requisition and this is my number. So you need to note down this, this number which would be helpful for me to put this number in the purchase order to get the reference. So that's my number in below. So that's it uh, in the purchase requisition. Thank you.